In the underwater forests of northern Japan, the residents of this sunken wreck are waiting for the summer temperatures to reach 16 degrees Celsius. That, for some, is the time for mating. giant wrasse called a cobodai. This is a male. And in female terms, he is particularly handsome. He's a meter long and weighs 15 kilos. Much larger than the diminutive female. And he is ready to breed. He attempts to mate with her and with any of the other dozen or so females that live in his territory whenever he gets the chance. But females from around 10 years old take little notice of his advances. This is because when any large female reaches a critical body size, she can begin a dramatic transformation. Over just a few months, particular enzymes inside her body cease to work. And male hormones start to circulate. As time passes, her head expands and her chin gets longer. A she has changed into a he. With this comes a change in temperament. The old male who ruled all the females here is challenged to a face-off. The more bulbous the head, the more it intimidates an opponent. females transform themselves in this way. But the change enables them to have more mates 
so they will have many more offspring carrying their genes. But a new male can't afford to be complacent. Inside the body of every Kobudai female, there is a new male in waiting. <laughs>